It was not a good good afternoon for us. I think um, you know a lot of credit to Wasp. They were up for it. They um, they defended very very well and they took their opportunities. I think um, you know three all. We were sort of I think on top that most of the first half. Uh, got to 9-3, worked our way to that, and then suddenly to concede two tries, an interception, and then a, a, a loose try from from our own kickoff uh, is very, very disappointing, and, and, and really left us with too much to do. It was really a game of, of very fine margins because not long before that you had uh, a try for George North ruled out as well. Yeah, it looked a dodgy one to me. That I had a little look uh, um, on the computer, and to me it was certainly. He was, he was even, I wouldn't say he was in front at all, so I think that was a little bit harsh, but um, you know, it wasn't awarded and Whistle should have done better. Adams Park has been a, a difficult place to come for the Saints over previous years, why is that? It's a tough place for A, for a, for a, for a good side, um, you know, they, they pushed Saracens close last week, uh, should have probably won that game and um, you can't take them lightly as, as, as we've seen, they've got some really good individual players, I think they, uh, they played well today, they defended really, really well, they uh, spread the field, cut down a lot of our options, they piled into our mall, uh, we didn't get any success from that, so they're a good side and um, you know, sometimes when you play good sides you've got to play even better. What do you take away from a game like today? Um, well, we take one point away, and we take away that, um, the feeling that we need to be accurate and, and a lot better than what we were today. I don't think we were poor, but um, I just don't think we were on the ball. I don't think we were, um, you know, there's lots of little things that we still can improve upon, and those are things we need to get right, particularly when you play away from home.